All right, so the 2013 Veloster Turbo chassis is built on the same chassis as the Veloster that we have now. Uh, dimensions, everything is the same. We also have motor-driven power steering. That's been upgraded, a little tighter feel to it because it's a sportier car. We got a turbo now, 201 horsepower, 195 foot-pound of torque. Instead of using the dual-clutch automatic transmission, we've switched over into a, a six-speed Shiftronic transmission uh, for the automatic. Also available, we have a six-speed manual transmission, which is good for the guys that really want to grind the gears and, and go to town, put this uh, turbo to its paces. The turbo is a twin scroll turbo. It's mounted on the back of the motor. We have an intercooler up front, which really cools the air down before going through the motor. That's it, it uses a 1.6 liter uh, gasoline direct injection uh, four cylinder motor. The same motor actually that's in the Velocers that we have now. It's just built up, has the turbo on it, and we're getting about 63 more horsepower out of this. Um, the stabilizer bars have also been updated, so it has a little stiffer ride to it, a little sportier handling. Uh, we have a little bit bigger brake rotor, 11.8 inch brake rotor on the front end. The rear brakes are the same. Uh, it just allows for a lo little bit larger pad, so when you're coming up to those lights a little bit faster, you have that braking uh, power to stop you. So, also available, of course, is in the vehicle stability management system. We have all the safety features, electronic stability control, traction control, ABS, electronic brake force distribution, um, available with the 2013 uh, Velocity Turbo.